Alrighty, YouTube, it's your boys, the Oxus, and we're back with another Goddess of Victory Nick Hay video. And in today's video, we're going to be talking about characters that we know are coming to Nick Hay soon, um, especially what they've been doing, right? I want to say, especially with like this new masked character, and then obviously Nero and then Rosanna, right? Kind of that order if we skip the limiteds. Um, you're going to notice that they're bringing characters that should have already been in the game, or at least like the second half of a lot of characters that were already in the game right so we're going to be talking about stuff that we already know is coming into the game these are not leaks these are all um characters already in the game um or at least shown to us in the game literally so and there's that right but yeah like i was saying um characters that we're getting next right i mean like the next character we're getting is masked right obviously the first character ever came in this game with a banner was helm Master is the second part of that squad, right? Nero, she is the second half of, uh, not second half, but she's in Biscuit squad, right? Rosanna isn't really, like, she's with Sakura, right? And then, um, who came up before them? The Bunny Girls came out together, right, thankfully. And then Dorothy and them, we don't really count, because Dorothy's a pilgrim, right? So it's not really, you know what I mean? But they're kind of going down that road of just adding characters that sh should have came with their other character already. Right, so we're just gonna talk about the characters that we know um, are still missing. So the first one that's obvious is um, K, right? This is a character who is in the story with D. This is a character that should be coming out into the game. Um, I don't know when, but sometime soon, I think, um, especially since they reran Rosanna and Nero, or not reran, but they brought Rosanna and Nero. I think K uh, might be one of these next couple of banners, only because Mast is also next as well, right? Like I said, multiple, they're bringing like the second half of these characters, right? And K was a character I think a lot of people do like and stuff like that. So K is a character that we know 1000% is coming into the game. Um, she's gonna have her own event and stuff like that, uh, because they already like. I guess you could say they already like gave us the uh, the scoop about her during these events, right? So uh, yeah, K is definitely one of those characters. Another character is Moran. Now this is the character who was actually with Sakura, right? If you guys, um, I wish that uh, I could see. Maybe I have to go to their blogs on Pride Win, right? Um, but a lot of these arts come with like, let me go to like page three, right? A lot of these arts come with um like the picture. Oh, I guess I can't see anything after that part. Damn. Um, but yeah, I mean, I know actually, there's a website I can use actually. Here we go. This is a website that you can use. Loot and waifus, right? Shout out to the YouTuber as well. Um, but yeah, the Cherry Blossom event, um, the image is not here, but like, and there's this like type of image where it's her and Moran, right? We already seen this girl in the game. They actually changed her design from what we've seen a long time ago, right? So I do think uh, Moran is someone who probably won't come in for maybe like a while because it seems like rosanna was like the second part to sakura right which um she's already in the game right so i assume moran is going to be like the third part to that whole lore right there um just she probably won't drop for like maybe another month or two um maybe three right um especially with the stuff lined up with near collab the anniversary she probably won't drop for a while but I don't know, but this character is definitely a character who is caring, confirmed to come to the game, right? You can even tell by their weapons, right? You can see K is a SMG. She's going to be a AR, right? Another character is this character. Now, this is not a character that they've ever, like, like, I don't know. This is a character that you've seen in simulation, right? I believe her name is, like, Enik or something like that. Enik? Something like that. Like, there's two of them, right? Kind of like the bunny girls. There's her and her sister. Um, there's two of these characters, right? I'm not really too sure if a character like this will end up dropping in the game. Um, but this is definitely a character that could happen or come into the game. It's what she looks like. We've seen her already all the time when you do simulation room, right? She's like the character that sits there. But uh, she's also a character they acknowledge multiple times, especially when it came to like the NPC poll or whatever they called it when they were doing the poll popularity thing. Yeah, so this is a character, and Nick, I don't know her name to be honest. I think it's like Enik or something like that. She's a character who could come to the game as well, right? Um, another character is Anchor. Now, again, what it seems like, we're still going to get information. Most likely, I think um, I think Anchor will still be coming out with Mast, right? I know they just said Mast is coming. In the dev notes, they said Mast is next. Um, and then they also just posted out the pictures of Mast coming out. Um, but I, I don't know. Do they have enough time to, like, post images about this character? Because tomorrow, they're most likely going to post the picture of Mast with, like, 
just her like standing pose and shooting pose and then that'd be 17th on the 18th they most likely show um her skills and stuff like that and then on the 19th it would be i guess the update maintenance or whatever to the 20th right and then the 20th is when all the stuff would happen i assume right so i don't know if this character is going to be next right yuji if she is after mass they would have her mass come out the same not the same time but like a week after master's banner they're not really talking about anchor but again just like moran she'd most likely be part three to the helm mast and the anis squad i guess um no not the anis squad the uh, aegis squad right um i think that's what's called the aegis squad right so most likely going to be part three characters whenever these part three characters start going out but it seems like right now they're in the mood of just dropping part two characters right when i say part two characters i mean like the second character who should have been here before right nero mast rosanna they're all second parts of characters who came in the past right um so yeah another character is shifty now this is a character i think a lot of people would summon for because she's actually a character that we've played with before in the game right if you guys played she was out for literally one day right if you guys played the full uh fool's days event you actually did get to use shifty and what was so cool about her is that she actually had the same mechanic as modernia where when you used her burst skill she would have like the radius thing and after like i think like five or ten shots it would explode and do more burst damage or something like that it was pretty pretty cool but like it was literally a one day event right for april fools and uh, like everybody loved it right everybody loved this character she was so fun to use and stuff like that so i hope they do actually drop shifty because clearly her kit is ready um she's already like i said she was playable for one day we used her um and literally right i think this is a character that hopefully comes out soon um uh, i don't want her to just be an april fool's event character i would actually summon for this character because she seems fun after the last time i used her right another character is papillon i think that's how you say her name this is a character you've seen so much, especially when you get to end game of the like of the game. She's a character you see so much, right? So it's a matter of time that they drop this character. I wouldn't be surprised if she was the next character or literally two banners from now. This girl is literally in like the story all over the place near end game. Um, you see her face all the time, right? You can tell she's already a sniper. Um, I believe Shifty was a machine gun, of course, and then Anchor. I don't know what she is. Yeah, we already went over that but yeah uh papillon i think i'm saying her name right she is a character that like very close to coming out very close um, and then the last character that i know of is liberalia right this is a character who's also this is a, a character who seems to be like the anniversary character but i know people have been saying that it's already like not confirmed but it's been put out there that this character is a liberation character um hence why i think you guys should probably start focusing more on campaign because you don't want another nihilister situation right if i i can guarantee you the next like liberation pilgrim like requirements are going to be you have to own nihilister and then you have to be done like a certain chapter right so yeah so yeah liberation most likely you're gonna have to own nihilister and be probably done maybe this new ch chapter 24 they're adding right chapter 23 and chapter 24 that they're adding uh Lib liberalia is most likely going to be that i mean i hope she's summonable but like i said most people are saying she's liberation and when everybody was saying not at least there was liberation she ended up being liberation so it's kind of just like i'm just taking their word for it without any proof i mean they kind of have like proof every time they say a character is liberation or a character is this a character is that it ends up happening right um so most likely liberation but yeah these are all the characters that are coming out into the game sometime in the future right i think uh like I said, uh, Papillon or whatever, or maybe K might be very close. I would actually not be surprised if K was literally the next banner, right? Because Rosanna, which is for Sakura, Nero, which is for Biscuit, and then also Mast, which is for Helm, they're coming out already, or they already came out or coming out. Literally the only character within that like time span that who has not dropped is D, um, or the second character for D, and that would be K. So... I think she's the next character but these are characters that are already like confirmed to come into the game just don't know when but these are characters if you like their designs or anything like that you could start saving for them if you were not aware uh, most likely will come out this year but yeah your boys the Oxus, let me know what you think let me know if any of these characters you have an interest for any of these characters i think out of all these characters obviously the liber uh liber Alio is my favorite one um but like second would definitely be uh shifty because she was quite fun Right, but for now, that's going to be it. You guys, let me know what you think. It's your boy, Zioxus. See you guys next time. I'm out. Peace.